Hey everyone, welcome back to Sketchy Saturdays and immediately my dog is barking into the video. Uh, this series has been gone for a couple of weeks. I, I, I just decided to bring it back now because I don't know, I, I feel like now is the time to like bring you a few updates because uh, you might have noticed that I've been like strangely absent uh, on the channel this past week. Anyways, <clears throat> apologies for like the lighting setup here. Like I'm wearing a dark shirt, so you're basically just gonna see like a blob with two arms as my head. Um, it's just, that's just how it is today. Um, yeah, so I feel like I needed to update you guys a little bit on what's going on. Basically, nothing serious is going on. The only thing is that with streaming, and this relates to me being absent, uh, this past week because I haven't done much with YouTube honestly with streaming I was really busy and I totally didn't realize uh, when I last streamed last Sunday that we have kind of like this big project launching at work we had it this week so I I kind of had it in the back of my mind that I was going to be busy but it just turned out to be a bit busier than normal so I didn't really have the capacity or the mood to like get down and stream and you know really focus on Dark Souls 3 especially like the really hard bosses that like where we are with Freed and the second DLC so that was it with streaming with recording actual videos listen I've been doing YouTube for a long time sometimes I just need a break I just feel like taking a break and this week was uh, a place where I felt like taking a break. I focused a lot on music, just like playing guitar, piano, being with the dog. Oh yeah, the other big thing is that here in Hungary, where I live, things are finally opening up. So I finally get to do things. I finally get to be out of the house, uh, which I haven't been doing much of for the past three months. Combined with the fact that the weather is the weather is getting better, you know, that's like also been taking up quite a bit of my time. So that's why there just haven't been episodes. It's not like I quit or anything. I am going to be recording quite a lot in the weekend uh, and getting back into my series, plural series, because I'm going to keep going with Binding of Isaac. Uh, you guys like Binding of Isaac. I like Binding of Isaac. I'm playing a ton of the game on screen and off screen. So it's just something that's really fun. The other thing is, you know, I've been itching to get into Sekiro for a long time. And I feel like now is the time. Now is the time to get into Sekiro. It's going to be a different format instead of just like playing straight through the great game. I'm going to do it kind of like how I did that Street Racer uh, little two episode special I did like back in November or December. Where it's going to be like more edited um, a little bit, you know, just kind of not just to have like half an hour videos it's gonna be more like a highlight reel of me playing uh, which should be fun because again i'm itching to get back into sekiro uh it's a it's a really good game and i haven't played it in ages i haven't played it so that's what's going on in the gaming front or the channel front i should say gaming wise again ton of binding of isaac is what i'm doing I'm also playing near replicant which is near Rep replicant i'm getting to the part where it's getting good and that game is really getting good. I mean, really. I know people have... I've heard from a lot of people that the story is insanely good. And it is. And now that the gameplay is beefed up as well to be actually decent, uh, it's just uh, it's just a really good one. It's a really good one. I'm glad I picked up Near Replicant. There's also a couple of other games I'm looking at. Resident Evil 8. Looking pretty good. Um... Returnal, which is unfortunately a PS5 exclusive, which PS5 update, still impossible to get, um, which is really disappointing now, because now the games that are like actually worth it are starting to like kind of pour in, well, not pour in, but trickle in more like, you know, I mentioned this before, like the only reason I'm not mad about not having a PS5 that mad is because I've played Demon's Souls. I've played Demon's Souls many times. And basically, the Demon's Souls Remastered is a visual update. Um, so, <clears throat> that's why I was kind of like, not super mad about missing out on it, but now that actual good games are coming out on the system, I'm getting to the point where I'm like, fuck, I really need a PS5. But, you know, 
like this is a worldwide issue not many people have it um so i'm keeping my eye out is what i'm trying to say anyways let's go ahead and get into the final part of the video the last time i did sketchy saturdays which was ages ago i decided to do like a little q a request um and i got a couple of questions from you guys which i'm going to answer today some of these i might kind of elaborate on in the future but you know let's just get into it coming from glambo first question is god it really was three weeks ago that i did the last one so he's asking which dark souls level area do you hate the most and why is it lost isolith well, it's Lost Isolith, obviously. If we're talking about just Dark Souls 1, obviously, Lost Isolith. If we're talking about all of the Souls games, I feel like there are some other contenders. Uh, Frigid Outskirts being a prime example. Only difference is that Frigid Outskirts you can actually skip. But yeah, Lost Isolith, everybody knows it's horrible. It's basically an unfinished area. And it's visually unappealing boring enemies it's so what can you do what can you do the only saving grace is that you can run through relatively quickly god the lightning situation is absolutely ridiculous i look like it's like something out of a music video i don't like a bohemian rhapsody it's like you can only see my head or whatever anyways that's just what we're dealing with um i was out so i only got back now when it's the kind of dark outside so what can you do TR asks, have you any interest in returning to the Darksiders series? Maybe experimenting with different builds, weapon enhancement in Darksiders 3? The series itself, definitely I have an interest in returning. Whether just me playing or uh, as an actual series. I know Darksiders 1 had a remaster recently, right? Which is... Honestly, the first one is still my personal favorite. Um... Whether I'm going to return to Darksiders 3, I'm not sure. Out of all three of the games, I found that one to be the clunkiest. I liked it. I liked it when I played it, but I'm not sure that's the one I would be returning to. Darksiders 2, definitely, because I didn't finish it. And Darksiders 1, because it's a personal favorite of mine, honestly. I might. I might. Uh, definitely not ruling it out. 3, though, I'm not sure. Okay, Simon asked what what it asked. I should actually use proper grammar. What is my setup? Uh, he had actually three questions. First one is what is my setup? Uh, I'm gonna do a full video on this maybe one day. Uh, what my recording setup is. I think I did one a while ago. But essentially, it's nothing complicated. I have a capture card running, so both my Nintendo Switch and my PS4 goes into the capture card, which goes into my PC. Uh, I use OBS to record both from the capture card and from like my actual PC if I'm doing a PC game. And with the audio recording setup, I have this mic, which is the Shure SM7B, really good mic. And that goes into, uh, what is, which audio interface? A Steinberg, yeah, it's a Steinberg audio interface into Audacity. And then I just use DaVinci Resolve to kind of sync, sync shit together. Uh, that's like the really, really, really simple stuff. But maybe I'll elaborate on this uh, one of these days. Because why not? That's always fun. Okay, second question is what enemy in every Dark Souls is your favorite and why? Uh, that's This boss is not included. That's pretty difficult. I'm... Not sure about like fav whether I have such a thing as a favorite enemy. I don't know. I like, you know, like the knight type enemies. Like black knights, silver knights and all that. This is a pretty involved question. So I'm honestly not sure. Again, I never really think about enemies that way. Which one would be my favorite. Bosses are obviously different. Uh, but regular enemies... Is there any that are like that interesting? I'm not sure. Uh, and the last question is, do I plan to play The Legend of Zelda? Um, honestly, I like Zelda. I'm not against it. But I think I played a couple of episodes like ages ago. It was like when I was a noob YouTuber. I, didn't, I barely knew how to record. I played a couple of episodes of Minish Cap because I like Minish Cap a lot. 
But maybe, maybe. Which which one is the latest one that's coming out? I think Skyward Sword is getting a remaster, but that's the one that everybody hates. Uh, but I might check that out because personally, I kind of have a soft spot for Skyward Sword, honestly. Uh, so that one, that one might be in the running. Not sure if I would do a huge one of the huge ones like Breath of the Wild. Well, that's the only huge one, really. Um, but yeah, Zelda is cool. And finally, last question from Nicholas Fry. What is your favorite game outside of the Dark Souls series? And that excludes Souls-like games as well. Well, I have a couple. Listen, I don't really have one favorite game, I would say. Uh, it kind of fluctuates. But I'd say the top three are like the Dawn of War series. RT except Dawn of War 3. So Dawn of War 1, Dawn of War 2, all the expansions. Binding of Isaac, obvious choice. Um, that I think that doesn't count as a Souls like. <clears throat> I really like StarCraft, both StarCraft 1 and StarCraft 2, and also all the fighting games. So, like Mortal Kombat and Street Fighter are games that I really like. Again, I can't really pick a favorite game, I don't think I have one. If I was really pushed, I'd probably say Binding of Isaac, honestly, currently, currently. But that might that might completely change. And with that, I think it's time to wrap up this little Q and A session. This was really fun. Uh, actually, if you still have questions, leave them down in the description because I'm happy to do these. At least we have content for Sketchy Sundays, uh, Saturdays. I keep saying Sundays. It's like too ingrained. It's too ingrained. Um, yeah, this was fun. What I'm gonna do is. Um, tomorrow I will be streaming. Sunday streams are actually fairly fun. We we usually have a good time here on the channel. So I'm going to be playing more of Dark Souls 3. I'm feeling pretty fired up. And I'm going to be recording during the weekend. So we'll have some Sekiro. We'll have some Binding of Isaac coming the next week. I'm going to be a lot less busy. But again, sorry, it's just been kind of like that. And the opening of things has really contributed as well. But... Yeah, Isaac, Sekiro, Dark Souls 3, all of those will continue. And yeah, again, if you have questions, you know where they go. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode of, this is episode 4, I think, of Sketchy Saturdays. As always, if you like the video, make sure to give it a like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications to stay up to date on my content. As always... Thank you guys again for watching. Take care and peace out. Goodbye.